Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Three years ago, the Department of Fisheries and Oceans declared nearly a thousand lighthouses uh, surplus, including the one on Sambro Island that is the oldest in North America, built in 1758. Uh, Mr. Speaker, they were hoping that nonprofit organi community organizations were going to be able to pick up the slack, but many of these lighthouses are simply too expensive to maintain. I want to ask the Minister, Mr. Speaker, will he do the right thing? Will he ensure that the heritage, these iconic lighthouses, are maintained by supporting these community organizations? Here, here. The Honourable Minister of the Environment. Well, Mr. Speaker, um, I'd like to uh, thank my colleague for, for a very good question. And this program, this program of sponsoring uh, uh, out-of-use lighthouses and, in, and sponsorship, indeed, of, of working lighthouses has been very successful. Uh, we've received over 300 uh, nominations. Uh, we are working through, the, uh, the, uh, the boards are working through these applications. Uh, we've named a number just in the last couple of weeks, and we will continue uh, to, uh, with this uh, very worthy program.